Midra's mats. Ooh, I'm right in front of the ball stop wall too. That's that's nifty. Hola. You dirty hoo haws. Have a good do a good bud. The hosts look kind of kind of crackheadish, so hopefully they don't try to smash me. Well, come on, buddy. Let's get this underway. Drink. He's dead. Whoa, what was that? <laughs> oh, you got backstabbed. And the wake up. And you're dead. Good game, good game. That was lots of fun. I had a great time. Usually I don't get to fight here, but this is one of the very few chances you actually get into a good position. Thank the Lord of Frenzy. Hola amigos, it's me, I'm nobody, and today I want to talk to you about a special kind of sword, the Sword of Night. It's a very anime type sword, but it does decent damage under the right circumstances. My favorite attack by far is the Heavy R2, which does two slashes, and if you press it again it's followed up with another two slashes, and it hits very hard. But if you combine these two slashes with the Ash of War, the Witching Hour Slash, it has the potential to delete health bars. And if not totally deleting them, it gets pretty close. You get this sword by going to the Cathedral of Manus and doing a long drawn out quest line. And after defeating the boss and defeating the guy in the wiener robe, and after defeating Yolan, or Jolan, however you want to pronounce it, you can give her the Iris of Occultation to get her sword. Or you can give her the Iris of Grace to get her summon. Which you can enhance by solving a small puzzle at the Shaman Village. The puzzle being dropping down a couple ledges until you reach the top of the tower. And when you reach the top of the tower, you will find Yolan's twin. Which you can then combine to Yolan and Anna's Spirit Ashes. But by giving her the Iris of Occultation, you get the Sword of Night, which has a B-scaling and Dex, and has a little bit of blood loss buildup. The most effective way i found to use this is to go up to your opponent and use a Heavy R2, followed up by the Ash of War. But you can charge this Ash of War, but it will leave you open longer, but it does more damage. And while the uncharged one only does black slashes, the charged up L2 adds a purple tint to them. My guess is that is the power of the knight, joining forces with your sword. Or something like that. Beware the knight, you scoundrels. But my build is quite simple. I got 60 in vigor, 30 in strength, and 46 in dexterity. And 25 in faith, but you can enhance this build even further by pumping more into dexterity. The talismans I use is the Erdtree's Favor Plus 2, which raises maximum HP, stamina, and equip load. The Shard of Alexander, which greatly boosts the attack power of skills. Then I have Millicent's Prosthesis, which raises my dexterity up by 5 points, which adds up to 51, and raises attack power with successive attacks. And then I have the Bull Goat's Talisman, which just raises poise, but you can swap this out with just about anything you want. And the spells I have, just in case I want to use them, the Fire Serpent, which basically tracks down and explodes near your foes. And then I have Heal from Afar, which if you do at your feet, it will actually heal you. And you don't have to solely rely on the Sword of Night, because it doesn't have very good chase downs, to be honest. So, as needed, you can switch out to Raksasha's Great Katana, which is excellent for chase downs. And it also can poise through just about anything. Well, that's just about all the information I have to give you on this build, and I hope you enjoy the invasions. Let's go murder some people. Shadow Keep. Um, where am I? And where are they? Oh, there they are. Hola! Hey. You dirty hoo -haws. Have a good duel, good buddy. Come on, buddy. Drink. Hey. 
And he's dead. Well, you're both dead. Whoa, that was crazy right there, man. It was a crazy little slashing of your bodies. Look at those crabs, cute little suckers. Oh, it's a thing. Eat thy crab. Go say hello. Oh, there they are. Oh shit. Scary. Drink. Shit! Oh, come on, really? He's just fucking falling from the roof now? <laughs> what the hell is that? Weird. Gravesite Plains. Oh, wow. It's a thing. Oh, no. Ow. Really? And he's dead. Well, that's good. Drink. Drink. Oh, come on, then. What are you gonna do? You gonna do it? What? What do I need? This. And you're dead! Mr. X-Man, I shake my stick a bunch of times because you tried to gank me. But, still, good game, good game. So much fun here. Running for my life while you take out half my health bar. Okay, we got people trying to enter the DLC, don't we? Well, let's go say hello. Uh, better trigger this elevator so they cannot escape because that would be bad. Then I'll go say hello. Hola! Hey. You dirty hoo ha hey. Have a good duel, good buddy. Hello there. Cool. Eat my meat. Drink my potion. And bye bye. You're in a bad spot, buddy. Infinite rolls. And he's dead. Oh, that was scary. Abracadabra, Holmes. <laughs> you got parried. That was a cool move, though. You gotta admit, I shake my shield. I was not expecting him to, you know, do that and my parry go through. A, I, I figured it'd be delayed, but it worked out just fine. Yeet! Oh, what is this? This is weird. Hola! You dirty hoo house. Hey. Okay. That's scary. Come here, boy. No, thank you. They're all, they're all bugged. I'm going down here. Screw you guys. Get your fat ass back here. They're they're bewitching everything. All right. The rink. Oh, come on, buddy. Really? Really? And you're dead. Hey. Whoa. What was that? You did like a 360 jump in the air and turn around and nip me in the ankle. <laughs> I got your host though. That's all that matters. <laughs> You're dead, honey. What was that? Hey, buddy. The chat. That was weird, huh? Ow. Well, that's what parries do. You shouldn't attack while somebody's spawning in. Daddy COVID. Oh, that that doesn't sound good. Are you down here, buddies? Oh, there you are, Daddy COVID. Hola. Whoa, crap. Drink. Oh, 
Dang it. How do you like my heavy attacks? Damn it. Stop it, you bitches. Drink. That's scary. Um. Ow, oh, crap. Oh, no. Unfortunate. Shit happens. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, it's the Bonnie. I always love invading the Bonnie. It's my meat to grow stronger. They killed a rat. That's not good. Hola! Mr. Spiffox. You wanna have a good duel, buddy? Let's see what you get. Drink. And he's dead. That was fun. Hey, you stop it. That was a cheap shot. Good buddy. Really? My bad. I hit the wrong button. Jesus, drink. You ran out of stamina, huh? Drink. That's got some bleed on it. Not good. Really? And pop that cap, Stella. Good game, good game. I was wanting to parry, but you wouldn't do it right. You didn't do it right, mister, lady. I shake my steak for dominance. Belarut Tower Settlement. Are you about to fight the boss? Hola! Oh, that's scary. Have a good duel. Mister, drink. How are you not dead? Now you're dead, that's good. We succeeded. What are you doing, mister? Um... You're not dead yet. Big boots. Have fun in the next round. I saved you, Mr. Divine Beast. You are protected once more by the filthy invader. Earl Liam. Okay, I can get down with this. Oh, there he is. Hola! Mr. Mans, you dirty spit fox. Have a good duel, good buddy. Hmm. Drink. And he's dead. I murdered your host, Mr. Phantom Guy. You still trying to bleed me out? Oh, using the same thing, hey. Well, a little bit too late there. You dirty hoo has. Bug ripped catacombs. Where's my where's my peoples? Hey, you guys. Ooh. Maybe I can do a little surprise attack. If they're gonna come back this way. <laughs> I wonder if they're gonna come this way. Kinda low down, if you ask me. But I'm an invader. I'm not supposed to be nice. I just choose to be every once in a while. Come on, do it. You know you want to. You know you want to. Oh shit. 
That's not good. Drink. And he's dead. Shake. We're we're gonna hit. Hey, you stop it, you dirty blue. <laughs> you die. <laughs> you almost died, Sarah. Sarah, the dirty blue. Oh crap. Did you enjoy this video? Consider subscribing to the main channel at Mr. Nobody Elden Souls where it's more focused on invading. Or the second channel at Nobody Elden Things where its focus is on helping and will be the main hub for invading for dummies. Subscribe to both and I promise you will not be disappointed. Thank you for watching, my tarnished. And we will see you next time. Like and subscribe or I'll death blight you in your sleep. This message has been approved by the mayor of Froggy Town.